A four-year-old child presented with history of epilepsy, inhalation of a foreign body. He had a hypoventilated right lung. During pre-oxygenation, patient threw a fit again inside the operation theater. Hi, this is Dr. Janik Ram from India. You're going to see a case of giant foreign body of the right main bronchus. This is the biggest foreign body we have ever removed. We're doing a scopy to see what the foreign body is. And you can see that the right main bronchus is fully obstructed by the foreign body. Look like a tamarind seed. This seed is hygroscopic, so it will swell. Patient was really hypoxic. We are using a hot optical forceps now. So we went very close to the foreign body. Held that foreign body very nicely. And when we were bringing it out, it got struck up in the subglottis because it was too large. And what happened was, we sucked out that pus and we could see that the foreign body was there right inside the subglottis and the oxygen saturation started falling down right from around 80 to 40. You can see that's 48 and then went to zero. And we'll have to do something very fast or else the baby will die. So what we did was push the foreign body inside towards the right main bronchus again so that we can ventilate at least one lung and then we had to go for the second go with the optical forceps. This time we held the foreign body really tight and yes, we could bring it out. And that is a tamarind seed which had swollen up. Very big foreign body. And you can see the size of the foreign body is such a big one. So the moral of the story is do not panic while doing the surgery and if the foreign body is in the subglottis, push it down towards one brain, main bronchus, stay cool and don't give up. Thanks for watching.